think the injuries are, you know, part of the game. I think uh, nobody's going to feel sorry for us. Uh, I think it, it's a great opportunity when you have the depth that, that the Yankees have. And it's an opportunity for other players to step up. But uh, certainly, uh, you know, teams like the White Sox and, and other teams, um, you know, are teams that you need to beat. And you should be beating, you know, two out of three, three out of four for sure. Yeah, I was, I was talking to the Michael last week. We could talk about long-term having all these players out. It could be devastating, but on a given day, do you have enough to beat the White Sox this weekend, last weekend? Did you have enough to beat Baltimore and Detroit? And they do, and yet they're losing these series. So I can't say that injuries are the sole reason. Guys have to step up. Yeah, you know, absolutely. And, again, you know, the, we're the New York Yankees, right, and we're playing at home, and nobody should be able to come to Yankee Stadium and dominate you. I mean, I think this is the first time in 100 years that we've lost, uh, you know, three uh, home openers, right? Uh, okay, se sec second time. But last time was 1982. That's the only two times now in history they've lost the first three series. Yeah, so, Don, I mean, uh, the, the Yankees, they, look, our goal is always to win a world championship. And uh, in order to do that, you have to be able to, to, you know, play over injuries and be able to beat teams like the White Sox. At home. One thing I've always said about Alex, the listeners know it, Don and Peter know it. I used to sit down with him. It would be like a master's class in mm -hmm. baseball. So I, I, I've been saving this question to ask you this. The analytics, I buy into analytics, Alex. I'm, I'm not saying it doesn't work. It does work. But the one thing that loses me, and, and a guy like Paul O'Neill said this is what loses him too. I always have this argument with Aaron Boone. They don't believe in hot. If you have four hits and you, it's, you're supposed to have a day off tomorrow, they're giving you a day off. Alex, you played at the highest level for 20 years. Is there hot? Should we believe in hot? Uh, well, if you don't believe in hot, you've never played baseball. Um, Paul O'Neill is 100% correct. Uh, it, it's such a hot thing, Michael, that, you know, when you're hot, um, the ball slows down and it looks like a beach ball. When you're cold, it speeds up and it looks like a golf ball. Uh, that's that's what I would figure, too, but they say, listen, if you're hot and have four hits and you're facing a pitcher the next day that we don't think you could hit, well, why should you play? But that pitcher might not be unhittable if you're feeling good and you're in a zone, right? I mean, you remember when Michael Jordan had those six threes in the finals many, many years ago. Mm -hmm. uh, you remember Tiger Woods over the years. I mean, if, if someone doesn't, it, it, again, Michael, it, it's frustrating. I love analytics, and there's an enormous place for it. But there's a balance, and there's a blend, yeah. and there's a human element. And if you don't believe in human element, then you don't believe in a Larry Bird. You don't believe in a Bernard King. You don't believe in a Tom Brady. You don't believe in a Dustin Pedroia, uh, and so on and so forth. You don't believe in Apollo Neal. Because, look, if you look at just data or you look at just absolute raw, if, if you don't know who everybody is, and I'm saying you can go box A or box B, and I give you a set of tools of A, and I give you a set of tools of B, you'll pick A every time. Well, A happens to be Raul Mondesi, and B happens to be Paul O'Neill. Guess what, analytics? You lost. So you have to believe your yeah. eyes, and you have to. It, it can't just be as simple as analytics. Macro trends are important. You look at analytics, but then you meet with your manager team, and you trust what you see. You trust the work ethic. You trust the lifestyle, and then you love the passion. If you're great at anal analytics, but your player doesn't like baseball, and he's a drunk, then it's not going to work. <laughs> right.